are you up? Greetings from the dark hour. I'm Scythe. Bring you, technically, an extended episode of Persona 3 Portable. Morning. Oh wait, I mean, Happy New Year's. Hey, you want to come to the shrine with us? Sure, why not? Mr. Usenpai prepared kimonos for us. Ooh, let's go. <laughs> then let's go get dressed. Come on, the kimonos are in my room. It seems you'll be going to the shrine with Yukari and the others. I want to go to the Tartarus this evening. A little while later in the dormitory lounge, Ken came downstairs as Akihiko was feeding Kuromaro. Good morning. Oh, um, Happy New Year, Senpai. Happy New Year's to you, too. Yeah. Happy New Year to you, too, Koro. Woof. <laughs> oh, man, I completely overslept. Why'd I stay up all night watching that stupid movie? Did you guys see it? It had these giant Amazon women running around in the jungle. Typical Junpei. Why would I watch that? Um, is anyone gonna visit the shrine? No, I don't believe in superstitions. Me either. Oh, that's too bad. Yukari-san and the others are already there. They're all wearing kimonos. Ken, you're a jerk. Kimonos, huh? Uh, I'm gonna run to the store. Hold it right there, Junpei. Uh, what? You're going to the shrine, aren't you? No, I'm not. I'm uh, I'm just going for a walk. Uh, yeah, right. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going with you then. I'm bored. Oh, I'll go too. All right, then. Let's go. Anyone know where it is? Yeah, the girls told me the directions. Sweet! Yeah, nice cover-up, guys. Anyway, it's not a daytime. Nanaki Shrine. The shrine is crowded with people visiting for New Year's. Have you decided what to wish for? Have I? To get through the year. <laughs> so did I. A common wish, but it holds a particularly important meaning this year. You lined up with everyone and made your wishes. There's nothing to worry about. I have the utmost certainty that we can do this. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's Junpei-kun and the others. Just as Fuka mentioned, the guys came up, up the stairs through the entrance. Happy New Year! Let's all do our very best this year. But man, you guys are late. Yucatan. What? Happy New Year. Hmm? What's the matter, Yori? For some reason, I feel like hitting him. Mitsuru-senpai. You look hot. I, um, <laughs> I mean... Stop staring at me. Happy New Year's, everyone. I've never worn a kimono before. Um, does my sash look okay? I guess. I can't really see it because there's a text box in my way. Fuga, you look... Wow! I still feel like hitting Junpei in the face. Jeez. This traditional clothing is quite interesting. However, it's difficult to move in. Uh, I, chan considering what you usually wear, that looks even more amazing on you. Uh, is that so? What is this odd sensation I feel? Great, she's become human on us. <laughs> but man, <laughs> I gotta say, um, you look pretty cute yourself. Really? Ah, I'm so glad I came. New Year's kicks ass! Yeah! Junpei-san, why are you acting so strange? Man, we got to see some great stuff today. Right, Akihiko-senpai? Uh, I, uh, I guess so. Hey, aren't you guys cold? Mm, a little, but I love this time of year. It's cold in these? Um, that's not what I meant. Junpei-san said that you guys aren't wearing anything underneath your kimonos. Yeah, now I really feel like hitting somebody. He said what? Huh? Wow, you've really taken Ken-kun under your wing, huh? No, uh, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Ouch! God. Hey, I wanted to do that.
The music has changed. Why are we always wearing orange? I feel okay, only because... Oh, sweet. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, this is the only place you can go at the shrine right now. Okay, let's talk to Mitsuru. Let's get out of here. So, did you guys finish making your wishes? Yes, we did. Of course we did. Oh, but I ain't telling what I wished for. I heard your wish won't come true if you tell anyone. Nope. Isn't that what they say about prophetic dreams? Uh, it's not like it takes a rocket scientist to figure out what Junpei wished for. Wait, wait, wait. Well, what's up with that? What, you think it's gonna be something like, I wish to meet a hot babe, huh? Well, shows what you know. What I really wished for is... Yes, yes. The same thing we all did, right? I wished to prevent the demise. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Let's nip it in the butt. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Besides, don't you go for younger girls anyway? What? Whoa, did I guess right? Creepy. Yeah, creepy indeed. It is now the evening. We have received a text message, or a phone call. Hello, this is Elizabeth. I'm calling to inform you that we've changed in Tartarus. I believe a path that was blocked is now open. One more thing. I regret to inform you that my sister has expressed a desire to test you. If you are interested, please enter the door that has appeared at the entrance of Tartarus. You can reach my sister from there. The call has ended. I'm being tested now. And again, the music changed. Go to Charters. As moments pass, darkness arises. Anyway. Well, what's that? Well, meanwhile, before we go up there, we have a new request. It's retrieve one bloody button. It's too. It's involving defeating death. Uh, unfortunately, I will not accept that request at this time. There's a silver door. Is this the door that Elizabeth was talking about? She mentioned a sister, so you decide to open the door. There are many doors. Hmm? Someone is standing there. It is good for you to come. I am Margaret. I am one who rules over power. Will that description help you understand? I've heard a lot about you, so I thought it was time I saw you with my own eyes. This is the Vision Quest Hall. It is a world inside you that I have prepared. Which kind of looks like the interlace of time. And it has the same music. I've prepared various contests for you here, each one in accordance with your memories. Do you remember the giant shadows you fought so far? Here you'll be able to fight them again, just as you did the first time. Except they're stronger and they more likely will kill you now. What do you mean? I just told you, they were made from your memories. I think you'll understand faster if you open the first door rather than stand here asking questions. Okay. Think of it as my challenge to you. You 
have the freedom of choosing whether or not you answer the questions posed here. Some are quite difficult. I want to think of you, less of you for retreating. Now open the doors of your own free will. But after you find an answer to each question, but we, but that would be telling. In this hall, there are many tests created by Margaret. All questions will be answered by defeating the enemy. Once you answer a question, you may claim reward. What awaits by defeating all of them? Prepare yourself. But first, we're going to go outside and save. Maybe I'll call it an episode. I was expecting me to be here earlier. Oh well. Tune in again for more Persona 3 Portable.